Welcome, I'm Ken York with Seminole County's Economic Development. I'm so pleased to be here today to introduce our Business Spotlight Series featuring the Sanford River Rats. I'm joined by their head coach and general manager, Ken Kelly. Ken, please tell us about the River Rats. The River Rats are the anchor team of the Florida Collegiate Summer League, which is the third rated Collegiate Summer League in the country. We bring players from all over the United States to Sanford um, to play in a competitive six-team league the league is really on the Route 4 corridor with the exception of Leesburg. We play, there are teams in Sanford, The Land, Winter Park, Winter Garden, and, and College Park. Here at Sanford, we play at historic uh, Sanford Memorial Stadium. Seats 2,200, and on average, we'll get about 800 a night. On our best nights, we have crowds anywhere from 1,500 to 2,200, which is our capacity. Ken, tell us about the daily operations of the River Rats. Well, operations here at the park begin about 7 o'clock in the morning. The first of our 10-man staff comes in. They will re-prep the field. They're going to make sure the dugouts, the stands, and the, and the facility itself is extremely clean, which is great for our fans. Our second wave comes in, and it starts with the players who usually come in. They do extra hitting and work on some basic skill things. And then they'll hit, they'll field, they'll throw, they'll get that done, at which point also our interns who come from all over the United States. We have seven interns in our uh, support program and our volunteers come in and basically we'll have about 30 people every day working at the stadium to prepare for and to present the games. Ken, tell us why Sanford is such a great home for the 25 employees of the Rats and the 25 to 30 ball players that you have. Okay, well first thing is that uh, the town of Sanford is incredibly supportive of our kids and our program. We have host families for 18 players. Uh, and on average, we're going to have between 18 and 22 fan kids come in from outside the area every year. And the community reaches out and helps us. They, they house our kids. They feed our kids. Some of them don't drive. Some of them don't speak English. So, you know, it's, it's a challenge to be able to place these kids, and the community is incredibly receptive. But well beyond that, Sanford and Seminole County are a terrific destination because they offer so much to the kids, educationally, historically. For instance, just right here at the park, we had Jackie Robinson play here. We had uh, other great players. Babe Ruth was here. We have had great players play here. And of course, this is what we'll hope will be the next generation of great players to, to have played here and contribute to that history. Ken, tell us what you expect for the Rats over the next three to five years. From my perspective, I want people to come here for two reasons. One is because it's a great night. It's an exciting place to be. Uh, we put a great product on the field, but, but equally important because the River Rats have branded themselves as part of Seminole County through the contributions we're making as a team to the county and certainly to Sanford as well. So that every night when you come here, instead of having eight to 900 people or 1,000 people, we have the 2,200 capacity in their standing room and people are coming to the park early because they want to make sure to be here. And that's what, that's what my ultimate vision is for this program. On behalf of Seminole County Economic Development, I would like to thank the Sanford River Rats and especially Ken Kelly for allowing us to peek inside their business. For more information on the Rats, please visit www.floridaleague.com and for more information on business development, please visit businessinseminole.com. This is Business Spotlight. I'm Ken York.